This video is sponsored by Wing Wing Technology, your ultimate flight sim hardware solution, featuring the Orion HOTAS current and future configurations. Hello everyone, I hope you're all doing very well. It's the end of 2021, a quick video to show that we now have RP-3 type rockets available on the Mosquito stations 1 and 6, wing stations only. We can have either 2 or 4 per wing. Warhead size 25 pounds, 60 pounds or 60 pounds. Armor piercing, fragmentation or semi-armor piercing. I'm going to go for 4 per wing, 60 pound semi-armor piercing warhead. In the cockpit, just four things we need to do. Master arm, on, rocket master switch, on, salvo off or on. Salvo off means every press of the button, one rocket will fire from either wing. On means all rockets will fire from both wings with one press. Off. And your sight reflector needs turning on. That's you ready to rock. In terms of controls, fire rockets, trigger button is how it's named at the moment that may change in the future in terms of the bomb run and the dive i would suggest diving from at least 6,000 feet agl to give us plenty of maneuvering time diving from about 200 to 240 miles per hour when we dive in i'm pretty much going to come off throttle because our biggest threat is going to be over speeding and ripping our own wings off from my experience in terms of the actual dive itself before we fire the rockets we want to be wings level also in terms of pitch i find the higher the better the steeper we dive the less lead we tend to have to add to the shot and we will have to add lead in terms of elevation however up to a limit of about 45 degrees if you start diving steeper than 45 degrees risk of overspeed is real the risk of damaging your own aircraft is real so let's get that done i'm going to go down by at about 35 degrees maybe 40 by the looks of things line up plenty of time to aim start adding lead in terms of firing distance is all going to be done by eye, just not too late is what we want. Felt about right and we've got a, a destroyed JU-88. And finally in terms of air to air they can be used, I would suggest the fragmentation warhead variant and to use them without salvo. Hitting I find is quite hard because they're mounted wide on wide wings. In terms of aiming, it's very difficult. Aim for centre mass, aim slightly above the target, and really hope for the best. Haha, <laughs> I got one. Not an easy thing to do. Hope that was useful, and see you later.